Kaufman. Referee Thomas Marlin trying to get him separated. We had a little experience with that on television. Oh, here comes Sweet Daddy O. He grabs Kaufman. This is a check. This is the check that I was offering to anyone who could put Jerry Lawler in the hospital. It's for ten thousand dollars. This is what I was going to offer any wrestler that could put Jerry Lawler in the hospital. Is going to get ten thousand dollars. I am offering this check to Jerry Lawler if he will come out here and say that he will be my partner in a match against Jimmy Hart. Uh, with all the things that you said and tried to do to Lawler. I can't really think that you think he's going to go up and be your partner in the ring. That's past history. I said I learned my lesson. I was wrong. Well, here's the king. Let's get out front here. Jerry, I, I, I assume you heard the conversation back here. You know, I've seen, I've seen so much of, I've seen so much from Andy Kaufman on television, just like everybody else has, that, uh, this is a little hard to swallow, if, if I might, you know, if I might just uh, be quite frank with you. Yeah, yeah well, come on in here. He's not going to... Uh, you're right. Uh, Mr. Lawler, Jerry, whatever. Uh, you're right. I've learned a lesson. I, I admit that I was wrong all this time. I'm sorry for, for everything that I've done. I just want a chance to get it the heart without one of his goons coming out and getting on me. I want a chance to get him one-to-one. -one. I know that with you in my corner, that won't happen. You'll be able to stop whoever he has. I want a chance. Now, I, I hate heart, okay? And I think you hate heart, too. Now, I, I, I want to just get a chance to, to, to do what I can to heart. Now, that all, that all sounds real good, but I also remember... Seeing you on television, right here on this show, saying, I hate Lawler, and me, 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 and all of that stuff. What? Was that right? Remember? That was only just talk. I was just running off at the mouth. I've been very obnoxious, and I'm sorry. If you'd please be in my corner, I will gladly pay you this $10,000. Let me just say this. Let me make a little proposition to you. I'll be your partner against Hart and whoever he brings. If you'll agree that this, that match will be the last time you step in a wrestling ring. Uh huh. Yes, I'll agree to that. <laughs> you heard the proposition. Now you won't wrestle, not just here, anywhere. I will do anything to get you in my corner against Hart, so I can beat Hart without any interference. He promises never to wrestle again. That's enough for me. You keep your money. I'll go down to the ring with you. Can you add that? Can you get? We'll get Eddie Marlin. You add the match. We'll take okay? a break here and check. the assassin he certainly got the bulk on his size he goes in at over 300 pounds the opposition Andy Kaufman Jerry Lawler Kaufman who made the promise to Lawler that he would not wrestle again he so wants to get a hold of Jimmy Hart Lawler Comes with that right hand. Kaufman turns on Lawler and throws the powder right in Lawler's eyes, and Hart and Kaufman embrace. Two minutes and 46 seconds, it's going to be a disqualification, as it was all a great big put on by Andy Kaufman and Lawler is the butt of the joke. Hart and Kaufman all stomping away on Lawler. Going for another pile driver on Lawler, and they slam him hard into the canvas.
I promised you a year ago that I would get even with you. I promised. It took brains, not brawn. It took brains. I think the, the wrestling has definitely cost Andy Kaufman his career, yes. There's no doubt about it. I don't know. I think some people were saying, Andy, come back to us. Come back. But it was too late. Oh, I'm the king. Oh, I'm the king. I'm the new king of Memphis, Tennessee. I'm not that longer out last week. I'm going to knock him out. The things that he would come up with, you'd have to be crazy to do. He really walked that edge. I'm the king of Tennessee. I'm the king of wrestling, Tennessee. I knocked that long out. I'm gonna knock you mad again. Yeah! I think Andy Kaufman was his happiest when he was wrestling and there were 10,000 wrestling fans screaming and yelling for his head. Fathoming why Andy Russell is like wondering what's at the bottom of the Marianas Trench. It's an enigma. I really knew it was really far gone when he put me in a headlock and said goodbye. <laughs> 